morning, everybody. Mike Bakke, PrincetonTrader.com, here for NTMarkets.com with your Tuesday morning pre-market webcast. Okay, everybody, I uh, hope everybody had a good holiday weekend. As we settle back in here and we look at the market, the thing that stands out to me is 2115. Uh, it was the low from Thursday, and it was the low on Globex. We did 15 quarter overnight. So if the bears are going to make any significant push, say, down to the um, – to the middle band, they're going to have to deal with uh, with 2115 first and foremost. If they break that area, then that can open up a move down to the middle band, in my opinion. If 2115 wants to act like a floor, then that's something that the bulls can build upon as they go up to test uh, the 26 area. And if they can get over that, they have to challenge and take out the highs uh, from last week, 2134 high. So, I mean, in the big picture of things, we pulled back last week. We came back up on Tuesday. We made a new high. Um, the, the bulls backed it off for a couple of days. Bears backed it off for a couple of days. The bulls tried to hold the nine-day. They were unable to do so in the overnight. They tried to keep it on Friday. This is Monday. Don't worry about Monday. This all folds into one trading day here. This is all trading day Tuesday. Um so with this break below the nine day, the only thing keeping us from going to the middle band is 2115. So um, that's going to be the real battleground today if we head back down. What the bulls would like to do is to start to create higher lows, not challenge 2115 again, uh, and simply start to build for a move higher. I think that's going to be fairly difficult. I think the 26, 27 area is going to be problematic. You've got the daily pivot sitting at 22 half. That has already acted as resistance in Globex. So um, recall what's happening here. This is no longer, you know, the 2013 macro uptrend, even though, I mean, the argument can be made. Well, we made all time highs, you know, four sessions ago. What do you mean it's not the macro uptrend? This is different. And it's different in that the the highs are being made, but you're not getting that next leg up. You continue to get marginal higher highs, and then we kind of slip back down. Now, that said, the bears can't make any significant progress. I mean, they t they have their time, they have a few days, and then they, um, you know, then then things head back in the other direction. It's a very two-sided market. The bulls have their moments, the bears have their moments. Right now, the bears are in the middle of a moment. Uh, how far they choose to carry that is going to have pretty much everything to do with 2115. Okay, everybody have a fantastic day. Follow us on Twitter at Princeton Trader. Come check out the website, princetontrader.com. Come check out the chat room. Uh, I will be back tomorrow morning with another webcast. Trade them well, everybody.